welcome back hope you're all doing great you might have heard about neem oil and how beneficial it is for our organic gardening so i would like to show you how i apply neem oil to my uh, vegetable plants and also flowering plants so let's get started this powerful organic spray is solution to the most infestations in your garden neem oil is extracted from the seeds of the neem tree try to get 100% pure neem oil and also try to find oil that is cold pressed cold pressed extractions yield highest quality virgin neem oil they have active ingredients which are very beneficial for the plants so the one i i am using is this pure neem oil this is 100% cold pressed i got this from this is neem bliss i got this from amazon and many of the neem oils that we get in the market they are not real they dilute with other ingredients uh, when you are purchasing neem oil try to find 100% cold pressed and 100% pure neem oil which has no additives in it so that way uh, your garden will be benefited from neem oil spray neem oil can be used as an insecticide and also as a fungicide as an insecticide it kills uh, aphids thrips spider mites mealy bugs uh, scales white flies these things and as a fungicide it kills fungus um, root rots black spots on the leaves and mildews so it targets it is used as a foliar spray where you can you can spray it on the leaves and also as a soil drench some of the fungus and some insects like larva and stuff you know which are harmful for the roots and the plant they they reside in the soil so you can use neem oil spray to eradicate those ones as a soil drench as well so this is the best uh, powerful organic spray that is necessary for your garden so application should be it, because this is concentrated pure oil you have to dilute this with water and as you all know oil and water they don't mix well so we need to use emulsifier here I am using dish soap so you can use organic dish soaps or any you know washing up liquids or dish soaps and if you use emulsifier oil and water they mix well together and there won't be any residues uh, on the plants and that way it is really beneficial I'm using um, this foiler spray here this bottle I got it from Amazon too this is really good and this is this holds one gallon of water I have many plants in my garden so I'm giving the drench uh, today to the soil and the foliar spray so I'm using one gallon of water for one gallon of water I'm taking two teaspoons of dish soap and the neem oil I'm using is this one by uh, I'll leave the links down below in the description box so this is 100% cold pressed neem oil and also make sure you need to check the expiry date if the date is passed and then the oil get rancid and it is not beneficial for the plants so make sure it is in the due date and give it a shake for one gallon of water i'm using two tablespoons of neem oil this is one tablespoon measurement I'm adding it into the dish soap acts like an emulsifier and this will mix well with water and I'm using little quantity of water here to show you how it is mixed as you can see it's mixed properly now I'm going to pour this mixture into the one gallon of water. So apply this mixture every seven days, once a week or once in every 10 days. So first step would be prevention. Before any infections or any um, fungal attacks happen to the plants, it's important we prevent them beforehand because um, they are in the soil and the soil is exposed to lots of bacteria and viruses so they always uh, fight combat it's because of the humidity and stuff in the atmosphere and also when we water the plants from the overhead watering they they hold some water leaves will be um, affected with mildew and uh, mealy bugs you know 
like th those things butterflies and moths we, they, they lay eggs on the leaves so they, um, they'll hatch and we'll have we'll see larvae and caterpillars on the leaves so in order to avoid all those things because this is oil when a moth comes to lay eggs they won't stick onto the leaves and they fall off so moths repel with neem oil and there won't be any infestation like you know caterpillars or eggs uh, hatching these things that's why it is very important to drench the soil and also give the leaves a spray every seven days just like we all wash our hair we need to wash plants uh, leaves and also the soil with this one neem oil spray every seven days that way it acts like a shampoo and conditioner to your plants and your plants will look lush the leaves will shine and there won't be any infestations and you can prevent you will have healthy gardening when using neem oil always spot test first some plants they don't like neem oil sprays so just a spot test on a leaf there is no reaction then you can use that but most of the plants they it is safe you can use them uh, one because this is 100 percent pure it solidifies in cooler temperatures so make sure it is above 70 degrees fahrenheit and below 95 degrees fahrenheit and in case if it solidifies then put the bottle in the hot water and then it should loosen up when you are applying this spray to your plants I try to give it when there is no direct sunlight because this is oil if if the if the sunlight falls on the oil it might burn the leaves so that's the reason why we should um, aim to give it either in the mornings or in the evenings when there's no direct sunlight that way your plants won't be harmed and also when you are giving this spray to your plants thoroughly water the plant the roots and then you can give soil you can use it as a soil drench that way we can avoid root burns as well this is safe to beneficial insects and bees so they are not harmed with neem oil spray when you see infestation on the plants like mealybugs or on the topic of mealybugs i have made an entire video on how to target mealybugs um, I'll leave the link in the description box if you're interested you can watch that but with neem oil spray um, if you see any mealybugs or mildews and other infestations on the plant then give the neem oil spray continuously for two to three days uh, until you see the infestation is gone and then continue after seven days so that way your plant is protected and uh, it is safe from insects and pests and diseases give this spray to all your plants leaves both sides front and back sides of the leaves and also on the soil this will protect from further infestation the leaves also shine very well because of the oil and I'm going to give it to this plant as well. I watered the soil thoroughly before I gave this neem oil spray. And also make sure there is no direct sunlight. Otherwise, because this is oil content in there, it will burn the leaves. This is Gongura or sorrel leaves. I'm going to drench this one as well. And on this ridge gourd. These are leaf miners. This will tackle this too. So if you see infestation like that, give the neem oil spray continuously for two to three days. And then after that once the infestation is gone then you can um, go for seven day once in every week hope this was a helpful video thank you so much for watching i'll see you in my next video very soon bye